What's going on everyone? Might go back with my first Mail Day recap of 2019. Have a few vintage cards to share with you. Before that, I do have a care package that came in from a member of the community that I'd like to share. This is coming from Andrew Williams, awesome guy who is a Cincinnati Reds and Bengals fan. Used to make videos showing off his TTMs and some in-person autograph successes. So Andrew, appreciate you thinking of me. He, uh, he sent this really awesome note and you know, he kind of just, uh, he's alluding to the fact that I've often mentioned that the Roy Halladay no-hitter in the postseason that I was in attendance of is just such a special memory and a great memory. And he points out that, well, it's it's not the greatest memory if you're a Cincinnati Reds fan. So we're just having a little fun back and forth. But sent this great note, went to a signing, got, a, got an autograph of historical importance, throwing a no-hitter at Connie Mack Stadium was George Culver, so this is awesome. Andrew, as you can see, the one with the paint pen unfortunately did have some rubbing issues, but it is an awesome looking photo and still looks pretty solid. The signature itself's not too bad. It's more the above inscription, but this is really cool. Uh, Culver no hits fills. You have the little button here and then the scoreboard, just an awesome shot of, uh, of an in-game shot and then the uh, game card there, the scorecard so that's awesome so thank you andrew and then this one turned out amazing with the white background the blue signature it made it out to me and then uh signed it and inscribed it 729 68 no hitter versus phillies so andrew that's an awesome addition to uh, my autograph collection that would probably look pretty cool slab too i know psa is doing the slabbing of the bigger items now so that's something to consider. So Andrew Williams, thank you very much. Would love to see the signatures you get signed, maybe on Facebook in one of the groups, or maybe I can convince you to make a video, we'll see. Now on to the mail for purchase-wise, and these are gonna be some vintage Hall of Fame Phillies. First one's a 1959 Topps Richie Ashburn, PSA 5. Looks great, card looks really sharp overall, nice color, focus. Corners, edges, I mean, it all looks pretty solid overall. Definitely displays well. Centering is far from perfect, but I think the 59 tops have so much going on with the photograph in the circle and the logo and the team name and color and the slanted player name. I think you can get away with a little bit of off-centering. Obviously, extremes are going to be noticeable, but otherwise, there's a lot distracting you from the edges of the card, so that's a beautiful example so really happy to pick that up. That was super cheap. I think it was like 12 bucks plus shipping. Next up is a nice addition. It's a Richie Ashburn 1955 Bowman in a PSA 7. So really nice there. I know a lot of people don't love the 55 Bowman, that little uh, television look. I don't mind it. It's not going to be my favorite design ever, but I think overall it's a pretty nice card for sure. So definitely some top-to-bottom centering issues there. Very common. But cool card there, PSA 7. Happy to add it to the PC. Love the shot of Hall of Famer Richie Ashburn. And then the final pickup is a 1941 play ball. It's a PSA 4.5 of Chuck Klein. Chuck Klein, uh, Hall of Famer. He was actually with the Phillies on three separate occasions. So a, a three-time Philly. He had the bulk of his success in his career offensively at the beginning of his career, five of his first six years. I mean, that's where he really made his made up a big number of his stats, won an MVP, triple crown, just crushed it. Um, then he ended up in Chicago, had some success. Next thing you know, he was back in Philadelphia. Then he was in Pittsburgh. Then he was back in Philadelphia. The last four or five years of his career, the time frame from when this card is from, he was more of a player coach. He really, if you... If you check out his stats, he did not perform very well. He was kind of uh, kind of at the edge. I think he was in the lineup from time to time or getting a chance to put the uniform on uh, on the field more due to his popularity in Philadelphia as opposed to his ability at that point in time because he struggled quite a bit. But this is an awesome card. Really happy to pick this up. I'm looking to pick up more Phillies this year, more vintage, especially the pre-war stuff, I think, uh, and some of the older... Uh, Older different things that are offered beyond just tops and Bowman, I think, would be spectacular. So a cool card. Really happy to pick this one up. And 
definitely uh, just thrilled to have a mail day and a new year and a lot of stuff to look forward to. So I want to give a quick shout out to Nuff Said Cards. I actually just watched a video of some stuff he sent in those back pages. Great stuff again. I know uh, I, I think I've given Andrew a shout out before, but I definitely want to be more conscious of giving a few more shout outs this year as well. Oftentimes when we're making videos, we kind of just rush to get some videos done and we forget about some of the shout outs that we think about giving. So I want to make sure I take the time to uh, make sure I do that a little more this year. So give a shout out to Andrew over at Nuff Said Cards. He collects a ton of uh, the old school stuff and I'm sure I'll be hitting him up for some information on some of the old products, old um, cards that I can maybe look into Phillies wise and also Andrew really helped me out at the National this past year, helping me find a Dick Sisler from 51 Tops that helped me complete my Ultimate Phillies Tops team set. So, Andrew, thank you again for that. Thank everyone for watching. Andrew Williams, another Andrew there, thank you for the sweet autographs you sent my way, and thank all of you for watching. That's enough thank yous for now. Comment below, let me know what you think. Hit the like button, subscribe, and I will talk to you next time. Have a great one.